Okay, guys, thank you for coming back and go join me with this experiment here. So, we have cabbage. We're going to do an experiment on cabbage. This is a uh, conventionally grown cabbage, and this right here. Uh, maybe it's a GMO cabbage, cross contaminated. So, this is organic right here. They pretty much look the same if you can look at it. Pretty much the same. Long, uh, ridges here this one right here doesn't have those a oh, little bit of ridges pretty much so it pretty much looks the same okay so gonna turn the stove on let's see we're gonna put them on we'll do three oh, hold on put this one here on three as well okay so I'm going to do an experiment. Um, I saw this before, but I want to just really see if this really like plastic cabbage, this uh, GMO cabbage. I'm going to see if it's plastic cabbage, okay, and then versus the organic cabbage, the all natural and organic ingredients, pretty much organic. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to drop them on, one here, the organic, and I'm going to do that one. Use my spatulas. Oh, Christmas is coming, guys. I love Christmas. Oops, this one here so I can turn it. Burn. Ooh, 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 ooh. Okay, and then we got this one over here. I try to like multitask. I do one at a time or, you know, use both of the tons here, but I can't do it. So I'm just flipping them back and forth. God, it's smelling really funky in here. Doesn't really smell like cabbage, Well, Okay, so what I'm going to do, whoop, 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 take this one off. Okay, I'm just going to hold them up over the heat like this so I don't burn anything so they lower them off so I just hold them up over the heat for a little while Okay, so let's just see what happens with the plastic cabbage versus the organic cabbage. Let's go ahead and turn these off. Oh, it does got a weird smell. Wow. So here's the organic cabbage right here. Okay, so I saw on, on video that you can't pull it apart or, or it may stretch. So let's see. What? It did for pull apart. You see that? They pull apart. See that? So it did pull, the, pull apart. But the last experiment I did, it wasn't with the organic. It was just, I guess, the conventionally grown. So here's the conventionally grown one here. Let's see. Look, I can't even, it won't even, it won't even, I kid you not, guys. It won't even, what the heck? Look at that. Guys, what are they putting in our food? What is going on? This is my first time doing this experiment. That shouldn't have been like that. That shouldn't have been like that. But that's what... Is it? Is it plastic or what? Did you guys actually see that? Look at that, guys. 
How can this? How can this be? What are they doing with that food today, guys? And you know, go ahead and explore some of these things. If you you know, just try it. Look at that. This coming apart right away. Just try some of this stuff, and you'll see what I mean. You'll see what I mean. This is the organic. You see what I mean? I'm just blown away. So yeah, I did see this on an experiment one time before. They were talking about the conventional go, uh, contaminated with GMO, and it didn't really uh, uh, pull apart, as you see. It didn't pull apart. And it's kind of got kind of weird smell. But yeah, that's the cabbage that's in the stores today, guys. That's the cabbage in the stores today. Organic. Look at that. Let's get back to where food used to be. Let's just get back to where food where food used to be. Please watch what you put into your body, guys. So here you go. Your soy experiment, organic cabbage, opposed to GMO, cross-contaminated. I don't know. But I saw it from my own eyes, too. I always wanted to do this. So, in a way, put in the comments what you think. What you think about these two experiments. Like I said, some of you guys are uh, leaving comments. But I appreciate that. And just let me know what you think about the experiment today. I definitely appreciate that. With that said, thank you for joining me. And peace out. Bye-bye.